So with an empty set, Kaiser said he wanted to have more of a variety, especially on first down plays, and he takes a nice shot underneath here, and it is complete to Equinemius St. Brown. And St. Brown. And here comes the pressure for Miami, sending five. Kaiser gets rid of it, it's complete. A burst for 18 by Adams. Notre Dame keeping it going and keeping it flying. There's Josh Adams flanking Kaiser. Fakes to him. Ball's a little low, but it's still caught there by St. Brown. A quick passing game right now. Yeah, Kaiser thought that the Notre Dame look was just too predictable, and that is a new tries to keep this drive alive for a possible touchdown on its first series. Kaiser with time. Throws across the middle. He's got the first down, and it's Hunter again. Close to the 10 year By Kaiser to stay calm, cool, and collected in the pocket. Keep his vision downfield, deliver a strike. Waited for Torrey Hunter to actually make a second move to find an open window. We had a good conversation, a very candid conversation with Kaiser yesterday about being pulled in the Stanford game. And I asked him if he was surprised. He said, I wasn't shocked. I mean, it really was a bad performance coming out in the second half. And then He's, he told us also, he goes, that's the last time I ever want to be alone on the sidelines, standing there helplessly as Zaire replaced him. Another flag comes in as Kaiser keeps it. And has run out of bounds at about the defensive end. Demetrius Jackson on the other side. As now the ball is inside the five. And here we go up the middle, and it's Tory Hunter Jr. who had a big series, which leads to the opening score for Notre Dame. Little razzle-dazzle in the red zone. Little zone read look, but it's a shovel pass, and Torrey Hunter reaches out with one hand to grab it. Nice job up front. Kaiser to the air again. It's right guard, Biven. Little left arm start. Yep, absolutely. Looks like he's already replaced Colin McGovern, and there's a flag in as that one is deflected at the line there by Chad Thomas. Side of the Miami red zone with first and ten. Play action, Kaiser steps up, has plenty of time, lofted it toward Nick Wisher, incomplete. Second down in ten. Tight ends just seven total for the year. But Kaiser, Kaiser wanted him. Does a great job of stepping up and avoiding the rush and trying to put the ball in a safe spot. If he had a chance to take a look front side, he might have had a, a nice... Uh, that's Dexter Williams, who's in the backfield. Kaiser with a zone read. He's going to keep it. And R.J. McIntosh is going to close ground at Notre Dame Stadium. And now trying to hold Notre Dame on this third down and eight at the Miami 20. Kaiser, pump fix, goes deep toward the corner of the end zone. And Kevin Stefferson not able to hang on. The Irish take over, looking for more at the Miami 13. Kaiser passing on first down, going for the end zone, and that was almost picked off. He wanted to Stanford game, which led to a safety and also had some bad snaps in the slop at North Carolina State, which you can understand in those conditions. But second down and 20, Irish trying to get it back. Just inside the 15 is another catch by Hunter. His fourth spreads it out, empty set. Two to the left, three to the right. Goes to the left. Is it complete? Yes! Touchdown, Notre Dame to Equinemius. This was Kaiser's first read down the field. Had an opportunity, and he puts his sucker in a spot where he can catch it. <laughs> he was saying some things to the press and said, hey, wait a minute. You know, you played one game, one or two games in your college career. Let's pump the brakes here a little bit. So he hasn't talked to the media since. Tarion Falston with another good game. So right when the bump, so he just turned around and took the screen. Quick little flick out to the left to Fulston. And he's up across the 40 to the 42-yard line. And the Irish on the march again here. With a second and three from the 42. Low throw. Fulston's able to gather it in. Then picks up the first down. Pump fake now for Kaiser. Nothing going left. Tries to get out of trouble. Pressured and incomplete. Antenna for Chris Fink. And that was really actually said it was disappointing that his AD actually had to get out there and do that. 
Michael Swarbrick felt he needed to do it as Kaiser scrambles and slides in. On third and four, Kaiser hanging in there. He's going to be short of the first down. It's complete to Miles Boykin who gets throw a Hail Mary up. Kaiser right back to the air. He's got Stefferson in the clear. And Stefferson now in a foot race, now dodging some keen defenders. Gets it. It all comes together. Amazing. Kaiser stepping in. Hanging in there and unable to come up with it is Stefferson at the back of the end zone. From the nine. Kaiser rifles it to the back of the end zone incomplete. With 5.33 left, 20 to 7 Irish. And Kaiser starts off with another pass and this complete to Fink. Action Fink draws the linebacker forward, opens up the window. Fink right. Kaiser delivers it to St. Brown and he's got the first down. This week against Virginia Tech. Although they do lead the nation with 71 tackles for a loss, but we haven't seen many of those today as Dexter Williams gets the call. And again, Kaiser on third and five has him spread out. Once, once, and down Kaiser will go at the 39-yard line. Shaq, you're still fine. And we all know what happened a couple of weeks ago in the first two series against Stanford. He threw a couple of interceptions and was pulled for Zaire. He stands in here on second and 12 and delivers it. Is it a catch? I really didn't think he had a throw anywhere, and he found this at the last instant. Wait a minute. Now they're saying it's an incomplete pass. Well, he drops the ball as the, the ball end. is loose. Kaiser buying some time, is able to keep his balance incomplete, and Notre Dame will have to punt it away. He so the Irish trying to respond here. As they've seen, the Canes score 17 unanswered, and Equinemius St. Brown with a nice reception here to the 48-yard line, and still dragging the pile close to... And the ball now at the 49-yard line. And Kaiser with a quick hitter over to Sanders. He's brought down immediately by Rayshon Jenkins. There's Josh Adams in the backfield behind Kaiser. And Kaiser is going to take it around the edge and pick up the first down. So an impressive drive going down to the Miami 38. Kaiser flings it out to Josh Adams and good defense there to become a real technique tackler before the season began. And here's Kaiser with another keeper. Trying to get around to move the sticks, maybe less than a foot. Yeah, inches. Kaiser slings it out to C.J. Sanders, and the Canes hold him and take over. Adrian haven't had a touchdown since the first quarter when they scored two. Part of that 17-0 lead. And Dexter Williams is just hit for the Irish to try to keep this drive alive. Here comes the pressure from the edge. Kaiser steps up, and it's complete to Hunter, and he picks up the first down. At the media that they are the healthiest, they were the healthiest team in America coming off the off week. That ball incomplete in 10. They come with four. Kaiser steps in, and the pass is incomplete. St. Brown could not hang on to it, and he gets up. So now down by seven, trailing for the first time. Kaiser goes to work on first down, and he's got his man at the 50. Punt resulting in the Miami taking the lead. And that was tipped by Trent Harris. As Kaiser feeling the pressure, gets rid of it to St. Brown, and he is hit short of the first down. Another big hit by 443 left in a tie game. Kaiser's just going to run this up the middle and maybe get two or three, bring up second. And a pitch to Adams, who just had the touchdown run. Adams for first down. Two unique plays coming at you. And now they're beginning, the to, get, they're beginning to get into Yoon's field goal range, and even better now that Adams moves the pile. 
Kaiser thinks it to him. Turns the edge, gets another good game. Oh, he's inside. Let's go. Kaiser dumps it over the middle. Do you believe?